All right, Sirenscape's animated armor sound set brings you everything you need to create an entire encounter with this fantastic bee Ugh, creature. Starting with spooky house exterior. You can obviously set this battle wherever you like, but we've supplied something to get you started. Fantastic. All sort of uh, spooky music and squeaking gates. Set off a crow if you like but it'll run obviously by itself let's go inside the building to the first floor perhaps the PCs are have been asked to investigate a mansion or something that's uh, the kids have been saying is haunted everything seems fine enough here let's go up the stairs through a creaky door. Okay, seems a bit more spooky up here. Third floor. This is where some additional music comes in. Slowly evolving, as always with Sirenscape. There's a lot of music in these two. They'll play for ages and ages and ages before they even think of repeating themselves. And of course, because there's two, three separate music tracks all combining in different ways, that actual combination will never reoccur because of the, because of the uh, randomness of that. All right, and what we came for, the animated armor attack. Let's trigger that. Customize any of these if you want to turn the music down and lift the general volume back up again. You can have more uh, of the foley sounds and the sounds of the armor. If you don't like those human voices, you can turn those off. If you don't like the clashing weapons, you can turn those. How cool is that? And what I like to do is once I've had the battle going for a while, I like to turn up the music and turn down the rest of the effects. So then I can trigger specific sounds for the animated armor when it comes to its turn. So it's amazing. And then victory will trigger this armor disintegrate sound, which I shall finish off. It's cool, isn't it? 